Hey, it's Justin, and today I'm in Palm Springs, and I got a house because I'm going to need the space. Welcome to the second video of my Magic Leap video series. This episode is all about being social on the Magic Leap One. I'm always looking for ways to be able to share what I'm seeing on my headset with others. And today I'm gonna to show you some of the ways you can communicate, collaborate, and be co-present using the Magic Leap One. Hi, Justin, how's it going? Throughout time, we've had advancements of communication from the telegram to video chat. And now with this headset, we've reached co-presence or the ability to put the people you're talking to there in the room. All of the apps I'm showing you in this episode, you can use right now on the Magic Leap One. And I think you're gonna be impressed. All right, it's time for me to do my favorite thing. Talk to people, let's go. <laughs> I wanna start off with a bang, and that is the Spatiate app. What this app does is it makes your entire room a canvas, where you can draw 3D art and move around your space. Lifting your left hand displays your palette controls, where you can choose color, shapes, and brush strokes. Your right hand has your tools. There's a free stroke paintbrush, a straight edge paintbrush, an eraser, and a six degrees of freedom wand grabbing tool, where you can pick up drawings and change their size. You can also save your art and open it later you can invite up to 11 other people into your room to draw art together. So right now, I have my friend Max over in LA. We're gonna meet him in Spatiate. Hey, Max. Oh, Justin. Hey. Spatiate synced Max's art over to my room and I was enveloped by his Los Angeles scenery. Could you help me put up a billboard I've been meaning to do? I would love to. What do you need help with? Well, it's actually to advertise the best YouTube channel I've ever watched, Justin underscore tech. What is that? I've never heard of it. That's weird that you haven't. It's yours. After some terrible acting, we started our collab. The billboard's bigger than the Hollywood sign. <laughs> And it deserves to be. You know what would be even better, Max? What if we did this in the same room? Is that even possible? Uh, it'd be great to get out of the city, even for a couple of hours. Let me see if my old trick works. Three, two, one. Oh my goodness! Using room mapping, Spatiate could detect that we were in the same room, and it was even more fun to collaborate. Oh, that looks good. And for your friends who don't have a headset, they can join in on the fun by getting the Spatiate app on their smartphone. They'll be able to view the artwork and use all of the same tools right from the app. The Spatiate mobile app is now in beta. Next, it was time to test this even further and host a Spatiate happy hour. So right now, I'm in Palm Springs, California, and I have three Magic Leap team members over in Florida in my living room right now. Let's go say hi. Hey, Joe. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? My living room was filled with people, and to my surprise, Steve was also joining us from San Diego. Everyone was drawing their own unique creations, and some even collaborated on a piece. Oh, we can make like a peacock with like a bunch of feathers. That sounds interesting. Okay, here, I'll start. I watched as their 3D drawing came alive, and look at how pretty it came out. Now in Spatiate, you have to let the art do the talking, but if you want to have a more intimate, animated experience, that's when you try out Avatar Chat. In Avatar Chat, you can invite up to five others to hang out. Unlike Spatiate, you can customize your avatar to fully express yourself. There are so many different attributes you can alter, but the one key thing missing are moles. Come on, Magic Leap, help me out here. So right now I have Tay from Magic Leap in the avatar chat. Let's go say hey to Tay. Hey, Tay. Hey, how are you? I'm great. The app supports a plethora of user tracking, which allows for more emotion to be conveyed. Avatar mouths move when you talk, and there's eye tracking, so when you blink or roll your eyes, people can see. There's also hand tracking. You can make a thumbs up or other moves using your non-remote hand. You can also cast landscape apps like Helio and Gallery to share with others. And developers can even build more landscape games for Avatar Chat. So I hope they begin to introduce more fun things that I can do in here. So at this point, I've shown you two apps that are unique to the Magic Leap headset, but there's another one that you can use that you're probably already using, and that's Google Meet. Just start a video chat from the Helio web browser and you can connect with others who are on their phone or computer webcam. So it looks like I'm standing in your kitchen right now, but in fact, I'm in my office in front of a black backdrop and the ML1 effectively subtracts that. It literally looks like they're in your room and can walk around freely and even cook in your kitchen. You can also move them around, change their size, and put them on your countertop. This is a great tool for connecting with friends and family because anyone can access Google Meet on their phone or computer. 
Also, the person you're speaking to can see what your headset camera sees. So this tech could be a great remote assistance tool. That was so corny, I love it. Up until this point, I've really only used virtual reality social apps, but after using the Magic Leap 1, it just felt so much more natural using social apps in my own space. And I'm not alone. Every one of my friends who played these apps never wanted to stop. I think it's incredible where we are now, but with the introduction of faster internet speeds like 5G, the sky's the limit with this technology. What would be a deal maker for you for social apps in spatial computing? I can think of a bunch of things that I wanna be doing with my friends using this co-presence technology. Let me know in the comments below some ideas, and I still have a lot of Magic Leap videos coming out, so if you wanna stay tuned, hit that subscribe button right there, and click the bell for alerts. And if you enjoyed the video, why don't you give it a like? All right. I, I've got to go enjoy this pool, so I'm Justin, and I'll take you later. Wait, go, stay there. Okay. Uh, like I'm doing it? Yeah. Hold on one second. You see that? It looks really pretty.